Hello guys, welcome to Expert Razor Academy. Today we're going to do a couple of little things for uh, points. Um, so the first one, what we're going to see is see how to convert an AutoCAD point to a civil 3D point. So typically an AutoCAD point has got X, Y, Z values. It doesn't have any other information stored into it. Whereas if it's a civil 3D point, uh, you tend to have more information associated with each of those points. Civil 3D points are actually called as Kogo coordinate geometry. I have a separate video on that one. You can refer to it. So civil 3D point can actually hold a lot more other property information, attribute information associated with each of those points apart from the XYZ values. All right. So now let's go and see. So on the screen, you can see that uh, we have some uh, AutoCAD points. And uh, so right now it has got just XYZ values and uh, have created a bunch of points up here. So now I'm going to convert this one into a Kogo point. So the process of the, doing that is uh, so make sure that you keep your points on the screen where, where you want to do it. And uh, if, if there is other points that's cluttered on the drawing, uh, make sure you can select it, put into a layer and then freeze everything else. And then so, so you can just work with those points. All right. So once you're all set, the very first thing is we're going to convert this point um, into into Kogo point. OK. So now you can see in the home tab. So we got uh, the drop down for points. And when you click on that, uh, you got several other options to create points and then point groups and then uh, creating the Kogo points from corridors, creating blocks from Kogo points. You got several of these ones. And the last three of them are the ones you're generally going to use. So first one is convert land desktop points. And the second one is convert AutoCAD points and then replace soft desk point blocks. So now we're going to use this option that says convert AutoCAD points. Now click on that and it's going to give you the commands in the command prompt. It's saying that select all the AutoCAD points. So I'm just going to pick all these AutoCAD points, press enter. And now it's asking what is the description you want to give to this point? Let's say I'm going to say uh, it's going to be curb and uh, press enter. And we can keep giving this descriptions for the other points as well. Uh, I'm just going to press enter, continue. OK, so that is done. So now, as you can see that this point is right now um, a civil 3D Coco point. So if you select it, if you go to AutoCAD properties, you find uh, extra other attributes that has been added to that. So now once it's in here, um, so if you want to put into a group and all that kind of stuff, there is a separate video which deals with that. Uh, you can check those ones. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. Probably I'll do another quick little tricks here and there and then uh, help you guys out. If you have anything specific, just let me know. And if you like the video, subscribe to the channel. Thank you.